everyone, and welcome back to new video. So in today's video, I'm going to share with you four sales I made on eBay so far today on the 23rd. I sold two sales, or two items within 15 minutes of each other. And I sold one item this afternoon, and I sold one thing this evening. So I'm going to share with you the four things that I sold. So here we go. I sold actually a wide variety of items. So, good mix of sales, you know. This was from a local auction house pickup. This I picked up over a year ago at my local auction house in a big book lot. And the first book I sold um, was in the profit after fees and shipping. And my cost of goods in the whole lot, I was in the profit. On that book, you know, I made a, I still made profit after fees, shipping, no charging matter for shipping, and the fees taken out, in like the cost of goods in the whole lot, I still clear profit on that book, you know. And this was the last book from that book lot. I picked this list this like the beginning of September, and this sold like the year, year and two and a half months later for. $1.49 plus shipping. This is a Kinmar Microwave Cooking. This is a Rubbon Cookbook by Sears in 18 And the person who made this, who bought this item, had no feedback when they bought this. So they made an eBay account just to buy the same for me, which is pretty awesome, you know. I'm I'm glad, you know. They made an account just to buy the same. I'm happy because I'm glad that I sold this. I don't have to deal with see this anymore, so that's awesome. You know, I made about 40 cents after fees and shipping. But I'm just glad to see it go. I'd take anything on that just to, get to go. Now, this is a good flip. This is from my Shop Goodwill Activity Tracker slot. Of, it was just claimed to be Fitbits, but there was a few other Activity Tracker and some watches in there. This is a Garmin 410 GPS Sport Running Watch. A charger, women's pink. This sold for $19.99. Plus shipping, and after fees and shipping, I made about an eighteen dollar and like eighteen dollar profit, which is not too shabby, you know. I did charge up a little bit because I didn't know how much sh my shipping cost was going to be with the bubble wrap and stuff in there, in the bubble mailer. But they make a little bit more on the shipping than I, than I could have. But then if I would have just informed. If I would have weighed it, you know, but it doesn't matter, you know, I made a little bit more money, so I'm glad I'm cool with that. And I'm still not on the profit on the TV trackers from Shop Goodwill, but I am about um now closer to um, $32 in negative because I did pay ninety six thirty for all TV trackers. This it was the sale I made this evening, this afternoon. This is an OEM used Briggs & Strand dipstick with a fill tube. 692047 This sold for $16.99. Free shipping. This is not off the snapper, this is off the Murray. I had one of these off the snapper, but it was B. It was a different type of one with a different um, color cover on the dipstick. Um, It was yellow instead of black. But the tube was black. That the dipstick goes into. And that's for $69 free shipping. Um, I'm going to make about a $2 profit on this. Depending on where it's going. But it's going to Montana. So let's say about a $2 profit. So not much money there. But it is something. You know. And then I sold my first beer stein. From the beer stein lot. I picked this up at another my local auction house that I normally source from. This is from an auction house about a ha about 30 miles away from me. About a half hour drive to get to that auction house. This is a Coors. This, that's the one that's on Hybin. Hybin.com one. You know, the other one I use is not a Hybin one. It's just their own. They have their own website and they use. They use Hybin. This is a but they're pretty late to the online selling game. You know, the person who, who um, owns the company is, like, really old, and he's old school. You know, so 
he's not converting to the online auction unless it's a really late, you know, kind of paying for it, you know, you know, and, um, you know, and making more money, you know, but they don't care, you know. But anyways, this is the one I bought. That's these from, they use highbed.com. The website's really easy to use, you know, highbed is. And you can find stuff really easy on their own auctions, you know, and buyers, you know, sometimes you do get good deals, even at, um, like, on a high bid auction, but, you know, like I did on these, but, you know, there's other times where, you know, sometimes the price gets driven up because it's easy to maneuver website, you know, you know, and some of these lower websites, you know, if you scroll through, you might miss the item, you know, you know, on a website, on a, not on a high bid website, the auction house website, I've done that before, you know, and I scroll through some way that way and see that, you know. So now I'm really careful when I scroll through things on that website. But anyways, this is a Coors Beer Mug Stein Seasons of the Heart by George Kovach, nineteen ninety seven. This sold for five ninety nine plus shipping. I think there is one one sold comp that sold for five ninety nine plus shipping, and that's what I listed at, and it sold so. This is going to go into a regional rate A box. And after fees in shipping, I'm going to be making about a $6 profit on this. Not, not a lot of profit, but, you know, it charges by your um, priority shipping regional rate box A. And, you know, it's all fine and dandy, you know. So yeah, in the S in the shipping fee will cover um the fees the ship my cost of shipping which will cover you know it covers the fees and shipping you know on the um five ninety nine and on the shipping price which they paid was like twelve something so which is awesome you know and I still come out about six bucks like I at um listing price which is awesome so six dollar profit on that. Two dollar profit on the dipstick, and then eighteen dollar profit about on the watch, dollar forty cent profit. So I have some items that you know, you know, took a little bit to flip, then like a really long time to flip, and then you have items that to take most items it didn't take a long time to flip. Like that book book took about a year and two and a half months, about fourteen and a half months. The watch took about like three four days to flip. Last well, it's Saturday and it's Tuesday, so I'd say about four days. About three to four days. This dipstick took about a week, couple weeks to flip. But it's not, you know, it's not a lumber season across the United States. So, you know, so I'm have, I'm cool with that, you know. Take about a couple months or a couple weeks, like two, three weeks to flip. But then this one's pretty common. There's a bunch that list of it. And then the Seasons of the Heart mug. Yes, mug this thing. Took about three weeks to flip pretty close to three weeks to flip you know so it's not too shabby you know i did pick this up in the local uh the actual for with fee after fees is there the buyer's premium fee and like tax and everything i think i was into that for about i would say like 14 14 something so you know, so fourteen something. So I'm still about eight dollars in negative, but some of these beer steins, you know, take a little longer to flip. You know, some are pretty quick flips. And these were these were not like the high the Budweiser mugs, these are like old style one coolers, but you know. But it's still pretty seasons of hearts cool. Some of these were actually, I think the one sold cup was for five ninety nine. That I looked at. I seen yeah, see. Five ninety nine plus shipping. And the one sold cup I seen was um six plus shipping. I mean there was one beer thing. I don't know how they got twenty four ninety nine for both. Of them. Maybe um. The other beer stain is worth a lot more. So then this one, you know, they want both, you know. 
But yeah, so. I don't know how that one charged five dollars shipping. Right? This one charged him probably was pretty close, but yeah. Probably sure as I got flat eight dollars shipping. But that one, I don't know how they made anything on that one. Yeah, so you see five dollars ninety nine plus shipping. Charged like the other two sale so cups and I seen. And I did it. And it sold so. So yeah, so I make about eight dollars. I'm just like eight dollars and like negative on that a lot, which is but you know what? It's gonna be a slow and steady profit turn, but I'm gonna make somewhat, but I still will make a profit so on that stuff. So it's awesome, you know. And then I got a couple more feedback. Um, Neurologic 9 said, Great seller, A++++ plus 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 for the Brooklyn Stern, Blower Housing 4932943 This person liked it, they got to fit on their own, on their, on their engine, and, and then I got delivered 8 videos, like, you know, to you. And you know, so, it's awesome. Thanks, Sam. Take care, everyone.